guys, Shed Bear here. I want to do a little vlogging with you. Post Christmas vlog. Uh, today's the 27th. But the guy that I'm doing the work on all them chainsaws and weed eaters and stuff for dropped by and he dropped this off to me because that light that I had hanging up here. I was telling him, you know, I had trouble seeing because I, I was using this thing. And, uh, you know, I told him my, my light didn't work. Well, Christmas Day, he wanted to come over and say Merry Christmas and uh, drop this off to me. Four foot LED shop light. I did open it up. I took it out of the plastic. Um, and uh, got the stuff out we need. There's the instructions. Uh, these things, uh, depending on your light, I usually space the chains about well, 43 inches. Let's check here. Let's see. Um, I think it's what I've got these ones here at 43 inches. 42 to 43, but I think it's 43 is what they're. Uh, yeah, right there, 43 inches. Okay, so I'm just going to put a couple hooks. Right up there where you see that that two before right there it goes all the way across. So I can screw right into it. I should not have to use the anchors. So I think that's about where I'm going to want it to be. It's hanging down. Um, I don't know. We'll just have to see. Um, but yeah, I think that's about where I'm going to want to put it. I think this thing focus sorry I think this thing here and this thing here I'm gonna put on this door uh, it was put here because at the time I didn't have my desk here so my little workbench alright so I'm gonna get this out of the box and I'll get you in a stand and I'm gonna go ahead and mark my holes that's why I got my tape measure here at, at 43 inches apart I want to center that where about where it's center over my bench you know because this is four feet so it's going to be you know about right there so we'll just see how long the chain is so let me get this out of the box and let me get my holes marked okay guys I got my holes marked about where I want it to be about right here this one I brought it directly over top over top of my workbench so it's not clear up against the wall so I am going to have to use an anchor on this side that's okay so let's go ahead and we're going to screw this right into this tube before maybe let me check make sure that I still got that inch away from the wall yep dead on my Okay, so put that down there for now. So I'm going to screw this in. where the the curve is now this thing all I did to put them on here I don't want to get down it's hard for me to get down and up I don't know if you can see that or not I just ran my hook through that little hole there there's a slot and then a hole I ran my hook through there and just kind of bent my hook over a little bit I'm making a mess of course let me find my hole here. That one, I think. Let me make sure. This popcorn ceiling's hard to tell if it's a hole or not. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my screwdriver. I'm just going to run it right up through there, just like that. All right. Now, I'm going to take my 
my little plastic anchor. And we'll shove it right up in there. Now that'll spread out once I screw this in there. That'll spread it out and that'll hold it. Same thing, just right up to the hook part. Now, we're going to get our light. What is that? Like I said, I already took it out of the package and everything for us. Then I'm going to run my cord right over and down along that coax there why they ran the coax out through the ceiling like that instead of the wall well I know why because that header board because when I ran my wires for the security cameras same thing but they just you know they don't care they don't care anymore nobody takes pride in their work but oh well it is what it is right okay guys also, hope everyone had a Merry Christmas. Then I'm just going to hook this around here. I'm going to hook that there. See, and then I'm going to take my cord over and I'm going to run it down to my plug. Alright. Now, let's go ahead. Uh, we should do that. While I'm up here, huh? Yeah, it should be long enough. Kind of like... I don't like the way... You know, they don't really give you... I thought I had a plug up in here where I could just run it up here and plug it in. Oh no, uh, let me get my ladder and I'm gonna check that out. If I got a plug up here, I think I do. If I got a plug up here, I'll just plug this in up here. I'll just run it up the chain, you know, just like that. I'm pretty sure I do. There's a plug. Come far enough back. Or does it? Yeah, well. It's just an extension cord for when I gotta run lights and stuff up there. Okay, so. Of course, I've gotta find a cobweb. Alright, now I gotta get me a, th a three way. I'll be right back. Alright, I plugged it in. I'm just going to kind of make this cord look a little better if I can. Then we'll turn it on. And then we'll really get to see what kind of mess we made, you know? If I get down without killing myself, <clears throat> now we get to see what kind of mess we made on the bench. Uh, all over my electronics. Great. Okay. Well, anyhow, let's turn this puppy on. 
Ooh, yeah, look at that, baby. Woohoo! Now that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, I can work on some stuff and then I'll still. I always keep this handy. Just I have to grab it. Cool. And I got it now to where I can. Whoops. Flip it on with the switch. Yeah. Or if I don't want that much light. You can see, this light up here does great. It's just when I have the garage door open, I'm working on something. I can't see because the garage door covers it up. But a lot of times at night I'm out here working, so, and the garage door's down, so. All right, there's that. Uh, let me get my tools off here. I gotta get this clock all cleaned up. I gotta get this mess cleaned up. Then we're ready to work on something. That's all right. Yeah, I can just, uh, yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Right on. Okay, you guys want to see what monkey got me for Christmas? Let's go check it out. Okay, guys, this is what she got me for Christmas. I've been wanting one for a long time. And uh, this is what she got me. The 5 quart. It's 4.7 liters. Cast iron Dutch oven. I've been wanting one of these for a long, long time. And uh, she got it. She got it at Walmart. It's a Lodge. Now, I like Lodge. I, I I just, you know, I like our frying pan. I've had Lodges before. Um, I really do enjoy using them. They're easy to maintain, you know. I just, uh, I really love them. So she, she got me that for Christmas. Uh, she got me um, a 10 ounce big bag of um, what do you call it? Uh, beef jerky, which is already gone now. <laughs> but and what else did she get me? Got me something else. But this was the main thing, and uh, I really appreciate it. Thanks, monkey. And she knows I've been wanting to do some cooking for her in this Dutch oven. You know, like you know, like they got there. You got a nice chicken in there it's it's awesome these things are cool I can make bread in this and you do it you know do it on a fire now you can use it on the stove but I'll be doing most of this on the fire so yeah so stay tuned for some videos of that and um, we're going to do some uh, cooking videos with it I've got more cooking videos coming up this year um, I'm going to try to get at least one one a month up uh, I want to try to do some kind of ghost, ghost, like a paranormal investigation or something to do with the paranormal once a month. So we're going to try to do that. I've got more fix-it videos, how-to videos, will it run videos. I've got more of those. I've got some leads on abandoned houses. So it's going to be a great year, guys. And uh, so just keep that in mind. <laughs> so we're going to do that. Um, Let's see here. Let's see if the four wheeler will start here. Hell yeah. Needs a battery. Yeah. Got it on the charger. Let's see if it'll crank it. Nope. That's okay. Or you can kick start it. Awesome. Love this bike. I gotta get a switch. I got it just got it hot wired there because because of no key. All that does is just make it, you know, and that you're on and off. So pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and Keep it on the charger. I got it on trickle charge anyway. Uh, there we go. Um, so, yeah. So, we've got some more stuff to come. And, 
I sold the pole saw Christmas Eve. I was just getting ready to bring the stuff in. Monkey just pulled in and I had some stuff out for sale and a guy stopped and bought that and a blower off of me. So, that's pretty good. Alright. Let's see. What else can we get into? Let's find something else to get into. Okay, guys. I got you mounted up here. I'm going to take you for a little ride around the yard. It's raining a little bit, but it'll be alright. Now, it's going to be bouncy, but let's take a little drive around the backyard a little bit. Okay guys, so I guess you can call that my post-Christmas vlog. It's just a vlog of, uh, you know, messing around the house a little bit. Uh, sorry the camera was so shaky on the, uh, my Stetson's not fitting right. Must have gained a little weight. But, uh, I just had you mounted on the front, but I want to take you for a little ride. So, I uh, hope everyone had a great Christmas. Um, I know we did. We had a great time. Her mom got to come over. And then yesterday she went to see her dad. Uh, I haven't felt well for the past three or four days, so uh, I'm supposed to be resting today. So you'll probably catch hell when she sees this video that I wasn't really resting. But I, I just can't sit around, you know. So like I said, guys, you you know, stay tuned for some some more haunted videos, ghost videos, whatever you want to call them. Paranormal is what I like to call them because I'm not a ghost hunter. I've explained it. I'm a paranormal investigator. I investigate things. I don't just go hunt for ghosts. Uh, whether it be just visiting a motel or something, um, we're going to do something. I'm going to try to do that once a month. I'm going to try to get some more cooking shows up at least once a month. I uh, had a couple requests for more uh, cooking stuff, uh, more recipe things and stuff like that. Abandoned houses, like I said, I've got a few of them in mind. Um, just getting the time to go i mean i got the time but monkey works her ass off so she took a couple of days off for christmas but um 
so I appreciate it. Hope you all had a Merry Christmas again, and I hope you have a great New Year. Uh, I don't know if we're going to do anything live on New Year or not, but we'll definitely film. I'll definitely film something for you guys, and uh, I appreciate you watching, and I appreciate all your support. What time is it? It's still early. Yeah, it's like 1:30. Uh, thanks for hanging out in the garage with me for a little bit, and thanks for uh, going for a ride with me on the four wheeler. Seems to, seems to be running good. I got to clean it up and. You know, I think I will put a battery in it because, you know, people want to hear it. They want to be able to push a button and start it. I got to get a front brake lever. Um, there's no front brakes on it, just rear brakes. So, but I got it tuned in pretty close. I think I'm going to leave it where it's at. Uh, the oil mix seems to be mixing. It's mixing pretty good on its own. So, I don't think I'm going to have to mess with that any. I don't think I'm going to have to mix it. I did mix it heavy at first because you know it sat for 15 years so I know there was you know there's condensation gets in them cylinders and you know stuff like that so again guys thanks for watching appreciate it thanks for all your support and uh, have a good weekend coming up and then right after the weekend then we we're running into uh, New Year so it'll be 2020 so Alright guys, I think I will take a little break now <laughs> and uh, kind of kick back a little bit, edit this video for you. So, again, thanks for watching guys, appreciate it. Shea Bear, the, the, uh, Shea Bear for President, Shea Bear 2020. <laughs> Alright, uh, Shea Bear, the Myth, the Man, the Legend, I'm gone for now. Bye-bye guys, take care. It's heavy. Jeez. That is heavy. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What'd you get, babe? Yeah. My favorite brand, too. <laughs> we were just talking about this just the other day. Yeah, we were, weren't Not we? Not my Dutch oven. Yeah. No, I could have used this a little while ago. Yeah, I know. <laughs>